Um, we are currently at Muller Chapel, kind of winding down from our um, full moon ritual, second one of this year. So my goal as president for these next two years will be to make sure that we are a known presence on campus for people who, whether they are currently practicing or perhaps have seen a few TikToks and think, huh, I would like to learn more about this and be able to have a community of people that they feel safe talking to and comparing ideas with. So since it was the Harvest Moon and uh, for like pagan stuff, Maybon's coming up this coming week, um, we were sort of focused on like, it's kind of the harvest and we're sort of like, it's kind of like pagan Thanksgiving in a way. So it's like sort of figuring out like moving into the new pagan year in terms of like the Wiccan wheel of the year. So talking about what we're thankful for. And... I was thankful for, oh, being here at Ithaca and that this club exists and that I was able to come. It was like really nice. So paganism is this very big umbrella term for a lot of different little faiths that are as old as Mesopotamia and Babylon all the way forward to about 1930s, 1940s with Wicca. They're usually pre-Christian or pre-Christian inspired. They tend to be polytheistic, ranging from about two to hundreds. Um, or they can easily be just like an eclectic mix of grabbing a little bit from here, a little bit from there. Um, sadly, in our sort of circle, we tend to focus a little more on um, European, mainly because I, as president, don't feel confident enough to kind of talk about anything outside of it. Um, I would like at some point to communicate more with um, other clubs to discuss more religious practices and magical practices from their cultures, but you know, out of respect, I don't want to step on any toes. Um, I'm personally not pagan or Wiccan, but I do practice witchcraft, and I have, like, for a little bit. People definitely have a lot of misconceptions when it comes to paganism and witchcraft, and I feel like people think it's, like, we were actually making jokes about, like, sacrificing goats, but, like, no, we don't do that, and that's not what it's about. It's a lot, actually, of what other religions would do or anybody would do. It's just gratitude and, like, being grateful and, like, acknowledging what you could let go of, acknowledging what you want to bring into your life. Like, it's really just, like, good mental health practice. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> and at the end of the day, pagan community is kind of about being open and honest with everything about us, kind of loosening away the mystery that media and, you know, rumors may have that, oh, pagans and people who practice witchcraft are just devil worshippers. They do all these horrible things that... No, actually, we're just a bunch of people who sit around a tree stump and talk about our feelings and worship the moon. 